Alright, what's going on creators? Man Snub G is on the check-in. Uh, so we get a lot of questions on the daily on what kind of uh, camera setup we use uh, and our actual camera settings. So that's what this vlog is about, man. So check this out. Four earn stripes, I'm honorable. Plus I walk through every locked door. I, I got the keys to the city. I don't need your opinion. I got options like a flea flicker. Well balanced, they say I'm self-centered. Right, so that cinematic sequence right there, man, uh, that we so love to shoot, man. We love those buttery smooth slow-mo, man. We shot that with the Panasonic Lumix GH5. This camera's a beast. And the reason I love this camera so much, man, the actual settings, man, I love slow-mo, and the variable frame rate option is a keeper for me. Uh, a lot of other cameras do not have that, so that's why I actually shoot with the Panasonic Lumix GH5. The lens that we use is the Sigma Art 18 to 35 1.8. Uh, again, this lens is actual beast, so the two of them together is, is, is magic. I'm using the Vilchox uh, EF M1 adapter. My partner Coley, he uses the M2 adapter. Um, there's a slight difference. One has a piece of glass in there. You guys can Google that, check that out. Uh, and for my stabilizer, I use the DJI Ronin S. Um, a lot of people use the Ronin M. It's up to you. I use the S because I like packing light. Uh, so when I'm going on different shoots and things like that, I just like to pick it up and go. I don't like having to spend a lot of time doing setup and things of that nature. So that's pretty much the setup that we use. Uh, let's go ahead and get into our camera set. Yo, yo, Coley here. Matter of fact, bro, you got me in focus, bro? Fucking God never has me in focus, man. Oh, shit. Every time I get it, every time I got a fire setup, you ain't got me in focus, bro. Come on, man. So today, man, we're talking about shooting settings for your color profile on the Panasonic Lumix GH5. We're just gonna dial into it real quick, man. Contrast negative five. I'm just gonna run through the list real quick. Contrast negative five, saturation negative five, noise reduction plus one. We'll get into that in a minute. Saturation negative five and hue is set to zero. The reason for these settings, man, after some trial and error for the best possible color grading, and Snub will tell you he loves color grading, to give you the most flexibility, dropping your contrast and dropping your, your sharpness uh, and your saturation is gonna give you a lot more flexibility when you dump your footage into Final Cut or Adobe Premiere or whatever you're editing platform of choices, man, so. And by the way, uh, on both of our cameras, on our GH5s, we have a C1 and C2. Simple custom settings on C1, we like to keep it at 4K, 24 frames per second. And then on C2, uh, we have a variable frame rate that the Panasonic allows you to shoot anywhere from 60 frames a second to 180. But it's important that you, for, for C2, for your variable frame rate settings, anything above 60 frames a second you have to do it in full HD. Can't do that in 4K. So boom, man, that pretty much sums up our settings. Again, these are just our personal settings. After a lot of trial and error, it's what we like to do, it's what we're comfortable with, uh, what we think produces the, the best quality level, the best cinematic sequences, etc. If you have different settings though, man, we'd love to hear from you. Drop a comment below. Uh, make sure you subscribe, hit that bell for notifications, man. Stay tuned for the next video, man. I think Snub's gonna dive into color grading, which is his favorite thing to do, man. Let's go. Understand